and welcome viewers my name is Harshwardhan Singh you're watching MS TV and the show is Rubaru today i am with miss Alina who is from Romania and the best part is she's a journalist so sometimes it becomes really easy for a journalist to ask a question from a journalist because uh, both the people they understand this whole art that this is an art asking questions and getting the answers mm-hmm. this is the art only but um, it it at some time it becomes difficult as well difficult doesn't because when it comes about opinions you might differ and as a journalist you will have all the facts and figures and everything to support that which you have in your mind and your idea but i think that's the beauty of journalism that you will be there defying someone but with a grace that's what we're going to do ask some questions and even if i'll defy i'll be taking that with a grace hello and welcome alina uh, you are most welcome to our studios namaste that's great So Lena I've just mentioned in the opening that you're a journalist back in Romania tell me something about about uh, Romania and specifically like what sort of a work uh, you do over there So I work as a journalist in the political field Okay we have also a strong mass media in our country and mm. because we are a young democracy a lot of young journalists are very enthusiastic mm-hmm. about do their job in this field to report mm-hmm. about good things and about bad things okay which happened also in our country okay that's that's great uh, so amelia when it, uh, when you just said that uh, you have a big mass media and you're into political beat i just want to understand what sort of your work is all about you are working internal politics or yes is- Internal Internal, politics. Yes. How does it work over there? I mean, uh, because my knowledge is coming from India only. India is a country which uh, is um, like undergoing the elections for the entire time. If it is Lok Sabha, either it is Rajya Sabha, either it is any other election. Elections are going on for the entire time. So uh, our political these things revolve around these elections most of the time. How does it work over there in Romania when you cover politics? Uh, no, so we in Romania we have elections every four years. Okay. And uh, between these elections, mm. we report about what is happening in the political field. Mm. Uh, for me, in my case, uh, my job was to report from the parliament. Okay. So about laws, about mm. project mm. to follow. the trajectory mm. of the law mm. starting from the sketch and mm. until they the completion and all yes they approve the the law and other colleagues they just follow some subjects about the um, political <laughs> projects that mm. some political men mm. they want to implement mm. or something like this Okay, and like that. And so. of course, sometimes we find out about some situations that mm. are not mm. quite correct mm. and then we mm. start our research. And we are trying to find what is happening. Investigative. Let's say yes. Investigative. Yes. So, yes. Uh, Alina, you went to a uh, print or digital or what sort of media into it was newspaper it was a newspaper yes when you think was i worked for 3 months for a mm, tv channel but it was it was not for me it's not for you Why no so? no no because you know in the in the tv mm. you have a small amount of time to report to deliver and the whole sometimes list. the subjects will go fast 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 mm. in a print you mm. have space mm. and time to go deep and deep and deep mm. but more and to research yes and then to delivery a full complete story mm. about a, a specific character or, or a specific situation great so alina um, how long you have been in india we arrived in 2020 in in pandemic in the pandemic <laughs> yes <laughs> some some great and time and we we to... spent quarantine in the hotel okay you know that's what i'm saying you chose some really great time to visit india uh, so elena um, you had a good like time uh, here in india in terms sort of like two years around right around two years you have been here in india only so 
how do you see the indian journalism how is it different from your country and what's the what's that thing that fascinates you about it ah uh, your journalism is stronger stronger okay stronger of course you are much bigger mm. than us mm. yes and you have more journalists mm. yes but what i can see they are very enthusiastic very enthusiastic young mm. enthusiastic mm. strong and keen to report what they mm. find out and what they see and keen to report the truth this is my this is my perception great so what that one thing that fascinates you about it is there anything i think i appreciate a lot the fact they are going mm. in the places where the conditions are harsh you yeah. know um protests mm. or in some places where i don't know some building crashed or mm. some big water came mm. and the conditions are very very harsh there mm. and it it is not easy mm. for a journalist mm. to stay there mm. to be fresh mm. to report right. and to be um, to to have a very good balance mm. in their report right, this right. is not easy you have to be you have to be very focused and mm. very motivated to to do this right and i think you have to love your mm. job very much to do this but in a word mm. uh, i like very much their enthusiasm their enthusiasm yes great that's great um elena i know that we don't have that much of time to actually do this whole interview you asked me to keep the questions as little as possible to ask questions about uh, as a normal indian that's a stereotypical question that comes up every time you visit india so tell me something about uh, something that you loved about india you have like spent a good amount of time here what's that thing that you might have fallen in love with or you might have not i love very much the people the people the people the people okay. it is the first things <laughs> that i <laughs> love things, okay. yes things hmm. that i love about india the hmm. people they are good they are tolerant and they are i don't know they have a kind of innocence the innocence yes um i not i have not seen mm. this kind of approach mm. uh, in other places you know i mean it's not an approach it's it's a it's a behavior but uh, they are amazing 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 great thank you so much for saying that, that. otherwise uh, i would have started my whole little life the food heavy with retaining at the place like that because that's what happens when 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 an indian meets any any anyone those who Of, uh, like, you know. of course i i love hmm. also some hmm. places here hmm. i love also some foods here great the, the, we are yeah. going good we are going yeah. good now where exactly touching the points that every indian wants uh, to be touched like the food the places the clothes the jewelry the color the festivals we are you're doing good thank you so much elena for for like, giving us the time for talking to us and um, being so open about the sort of journey which is happening over there in romania and talking about your work and and the perspective that you have about in journalism as well thank you so much for that it was Thank a you. pleasure talking to you Thank you.